hello guys today in this video I am going to discuss about when how to fix this error instance failure for system dot invalid operation exception so here is one scenario where I will get this error so I have created one project and here I am going to like create a model using database so when creating a model if we put some wrong connection string here like this then we get this kind of error so let me first paste the same thing here in the package manager console to create a model inside the models folder so here you can see I have passed my this is actually the complete machine name my machine name and the like a database name and all these fields are correct completely in the connection string so it should run right but when I will run this like I am going to hit enter here then you can see it's build started also it will like succeed okay but it will throw an error and that error is instance failure right so how we can fix this so that's the main thing right so here you can see this is system dot invalid exceptions instance failure error so to fix this error what we can do we can just do one thing here and what is that thing that is the thing here we just need to put here the dot we need not to pass the complete name of our machine we will just put a dot okay and then I will again hit enter here and now it will create the model from the database so you can see here the model folder is created here okay and also here you can see web API context is created and it is also present inside the models folder so everything whatever it is like uh, gathered from the database tables it created and kept inside the models and make sure that for executing this command make sure that you have installed all these packages here you can see the four packages the first four packages which is related to the entity framework core okay you need to install the that four packages and also make sure that you have chosen the correct project and in my case here only I have I have only one project that's why it is a default pack but if you have more than one project then make sure that you have installed all those pack those packages in the same project where you are executing this command or running this command okay so that's all guys in this video thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe to the channel